It looks a bit Harry Potter. Does this look like Harry Potter to you? So I think this is kind of like the main, there's a shopping mall. Yeah. Uh, and this is kind of like the main like walking street thing almost. What's it called? Queen. Queen's, Queen's Road. Queen's Road, where we're walking down now. Very busy. It's not quite Regent Street or Oxford Street, but it is Queen Street, Queen's Road in Oxford. So there you go. <laughs> uh, there's some nice buildings, nice buildings, buildings. I mean, I just was kind of looking it up. I sort of thought it was anyway, but the uh, style of architecture of uh, most of Oxford is kind of Gothic, but then I guess Baroque as well, as you can kind of see. Above that bus and here, kind of Gothic. Gothic is kind of, um, I guess, characterized a lot by these um, spire type things, the pointy bits, basically. Uh, and then Baroque is a bit more uh, ornate. Um, yes, if you're interested, like Gothic, um, architecture is actually one of my favorite kind of more uh, historic architectures, I think. Just because it's, the, you know, it has these arches, it has the these spires with almost the, I don't know what you call them, the little bubbles on them. Uh, and then these arches, you know, which kind of make up uh, the larger building. Anyway, yeah, that's my architecture lesson for now. Uh, let's just keep looking at things. So, this is the church. Not sure we're going in yet. Just gonna check how much it costs. I just spoken to a lovely man there who was a guard, and he said to me very nicely that we can come to the evening, um, evening uh, kind of a song um, performance here with the choir at 6 p.m. and it lasts for, uh, 45 minutes. Uh, we can also see a little bit of a garden there. Um, and now we have to also go to the left to see a meadow because, yeah, it's something nice to see as well. So we probably experience the cathedral later. So yeah, it usually costs how much? 16? Yeah, so it usually costs about 16 pounds for uh, to get in and look at the whole thing. But you can kind of we're about to go to the meadow now. We'll go check that out. Um, and then we just but then, go to the yeah, but then at six o'clock there is the choir. Yeah, so the choir is like six o'clock on a Sunday. Uh, he did say to get there at quarter to six. Yeah. Yeah, just to make sure you can get in. And you get in via that door there, is it? Yes, that, there's that kind of door. two big uh, arches. Yeah. Oh yeah, where you cross across. Them. Yeah there and you go to the yeah. otherwise yeah there's the meadow which we're going to now um, and if you want to walk around the whole thing during the day or not without the choir uh, you can go to like a ticket office which is kind of I guess around down here somewhere and pay around 16 pounds which again not sure I want to do people want to really experience in details uh, the city and, the, and are here once because they're traveling then I think it's really worth and, and, and you should do that if you have time. For us today it's actually more important to wander around and see more things uh, so I think we leave it for another time. Yeah I mean if we had more time we'd um, you know, actually yeah, this was kind of like this whole thing was more or less on a whim-ish, you know, so um, we're only here for the day, yeah. but if we had more time. If you had a 
weekend, uh, that's worth. Yeah. yeah, it'd be worth you know actually yeah. stopping and you know spending quite a lot of time like actually going around the whole building. But yeah, I mean, otherwise you know spending sixteen pounds just to rush around and look at things, you know, we don't really. Uh, well, we hadn't really planned anything, let alone spending sixteen pounds on something we don't really know what it is. Anyway, uh, this I believe is the meadow here. There's the shop uh, with the tickets. Uh, I did notice somewhere, it does say gates closed there at 4.30, but the last entrance, if you've got a ticket to get in there, is um, four o'clock. And then they close at five. And then obviously at six is the choir on a Sunday. Whether that's every Sunday, I don't know. Uh, it seems like they had a sign up that they put up and take down. Uh, yeah. So anyway, this is this the meadow? This is the meadow. Yeah. This is the place they filmed Harry Potter. The school, because the school is inside the cathedral, but is this the outside as well? I think so. Yeah, it looks a bit Harry Potter. It looks Does this look like Harry Potter to you? So I thought I'd just uh, do a quick brief interlude. Oh look, there's a thing. Oh, and you can hear the um, organ. Uh, Oxford. Why is it called Oxford? So, Ford is like a river. And basically it actually, there's a river where things can cross. So it's quite a low, kind of easily passable river. That's a Ford. And Ox is of course the oxes or you know I guess even back then like cows ox you know farm creatures um so it's where the oxes crossed the river <laughs> uh yeah just a quick little thing then uh and yeah we can hear the uh, organ not sure if you guys will be able to hear it is there a service on now or is he just practicing? Just Maybe practicing. he's practicing. I think he's practicing. Pretty sure I heard it. Pretty sure I just heard he made a mistake. So <laughs> I think I think he's just practicing. <laughs> As you can see, there's quite a lot of uh, cobblestone roads. Uh, quite unusual to see. I guess maybe not unusual in Oxford. Uh, terrible on the uh, the what, the suspension of your cars, and terrible for high heels. But you know, really nice uh, traditional road yeah. thing. Uh, yeah. Just wear flat shoes. Yeah, make sure you wear flat shoes. No high heels on cobbled roads. Some of them look, do look like they've obviously been remade and stuff. Should we just go down here? Just because? because kind of just exploring. The tree looks amazing. Da, 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 da. Very old building. Okay. Very old pine tree here. Pine tree. And so this is the University so College. Uh, here's another thing over here. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, there was a sign up just there that um, became part of the college in 1959. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what it was before that. Mm -hmm. 